Hi guys, I'm Exactly and welcome back to another episode of uh, some airport. Yes, <laughs> that's what we're playing. So we're playing some airport. Okay, um, in the last episode, I redid all of our uh, baggage carousel stuff over here. So let me just quickly or baggage um, handling stuff. And what I wanted to do is I wanted to add in one more uh, right there and make sure to. Um, actually kind of connect that up in this general direction like so and similarly I want to run this one up here and tie it in there so then that should be sufficient then that's the finalized piece of the action over there so we've got lots of planes hanging around doing their thing uh, the one thing that is frustrating me a little bit is the fact that on the utilities I can't seem to be putting both of these into this to then move it over here so so sorts and routes incoming bags downstream to other endpoints including other hubs but for some reason it's not actually allowing me to do that So what does H mean and what does R mean and why the hell can't I hook this up to that side? Okay, so if I do that, for some reason I can do that. Oh yeah, well that's, that's just not from a hub. Can I do, I can't touch these segments together. I. Hang on, can I do this one? No, they don't, it's, for some reason they just don't want me to make use of this hub to go through there. So that's always going to be a bit of a, a problem for us, I, th I feel. Okay, how many vehicle slots? Five vehicle slots. Let's assign some vehicles. Add. Uh, let's do an extra baggage car over here and we'll assign as soon as that plane leaves we'll we'll look how we do that close this oh it is leaving now assign it to must be assigned to an aircraft gate unassign over there and assign over here please and did we finish off that utility build over here or are they still busy? No, I think that's been finished off. Excellent. So that's done. Now, shall we look into our big gate over here? So let's get our objects. Let's quickly have a look. So if we add another large, it's kind of going to go in the way over there. If we add the extra large, my question is going to be, we should probably be able I add otherwise if I had that it's either way it's either gonna be half on this side or half on that side so let's build this one and let's see and this is not definitely not gate C oh it is gate C1 it's exactly gate C1 you're very that's correct so let's get that built uh, can we get rid of our planning that we that we've got going on over here okay and like so so that's getting rid of our planning this area over here will still be uh, expansion of the terminal I'm quite keen to see if this will work <laughs> if I <laughs> it's gonna look funny guys it's gonna look really funny so if I do a door objects doors and if I for instance do that door uh, right there that oh, I hate this don't have the room to do much more than that let's add that door over there and what I'll do is I'm actually gonna do um, ok 
Okay, so let's do the let's do the gate uh, gate gate desk, right? Gate gate agent desk. And how many are we going to do here? How does the gate agent desks work? All on the one side, right? So really, we need one like that. <laughs> or shall we do one like this? Yeah, I think that's probably better. Let's do one like that and one like one like that. See how that goes. <clears throat> we could potentially even add one more if we if, if that if we feel that is that becomes a problem. But I think for the moment it is okay. So let's see let us assign Let's assign this one over here, please. So we've got that assigned. Let's assign it here and assign it there. So now, effectively, that should be fine. What requires a door to the terminal? That is the problem. We can't actually squeeze it like this. That is an issue. Okay, so shall we dismantle this one? And we'll dismantle that one and we'll squeeze it in a little bit more that way. So let's dismantle this one too. And what I'm going to do is I am actually going to build a new wall. Uh, say here like so so that I can have these two blocks over there and we can actually actually that to be honest so hang on go back to the objects give me the super duper sizey one Okay, pop that in there. Let's dismantle some of this. Let's dismantle the sliding door over here. Well, let's just cancel. Okay, it's been... And now the whole secure thing is probably... No, no, it's not going to be a problem. But anyway, get my walls back. get me some more objects. It's a little bit finicky all of these things so let's go back to doors, get the large sliding door um, pop it in like that so that'll be sorted out over there. I'm gonna have to build the other big one over here so let's me let me grab the other big one and let's let's get started with build well Can we build the rest of this though? Okay, if I go into construction and foundation Can I do that? No, I cannot. So what I'll do is I'll start off by building that Before I start clearing out this stuff, let's have a look at what, what we can actually do. So I, I do feel that they should be closer to the... To the center maybe? No, I'd never go in the center though. Or to the edge then. Yeah, if it was on the edge, both of these would work. One there and one there. No, my friend, you see two. Thank you. Oh, yes, we got rid of D. Ok, 
Okay, so objects, let's go with gate agents. Um, and so what I would like is we'll do one here and one there. Okay, and that feeds in on this side and on that side. I think that's pretty good. Uh, over here, under construction, what we can do is we can clear out that section through there. Requires a door to the terminal, so... Ooh, yeah, it's not going to work. I'm going to have to do a little bit more foundation right over here. So, uh, we're talking about... We're going to need to do something like this. Okay, in order to make sure that we can actually... Uh, cancel. Let's try. Let's try the two. That'll never work. <laughs> That'll never work. Uh, uh, because that's a f a major door right there. Uh, hang on. Cancel that again. Cancel this project. Let's try that. But that'll never work either. Gonna need to. Gonna need to. I'm not sure that'll work. Let's see what what we get. Okay, so let's see a sign here and there, and a sign over there. That's done. It requires at least one gate agent desk to be assigned. It's assigned, so effectively this can now start working. Not that we've got anything scheduled there, but let's see what happens. Why are you guys running around over here? I don't know. Are you going to build that? Is that out of limits? Is that buildable? Is that... what's the issue? I want to see if this... Oh, I don't doubt this can work. We need going to need that one. So that, those two spaces, we're going to need to bring out that even one more if we want to squeeze these in. Look at this. This is just walls that are building over here. This is just walls. Oh, so we need to. Yeah, so you see, this will never work. And even if we let's go to objects, now it's going to look extremely funny if if we do get this to work. Yeah, so that doesn't actually work. So what we're going to need to do is we're going to need a, an extra little row of foundation right there so that we can clear out that piece of wall there. In which case, it means we're going to have to go and build another piece of wall over here. Okay, so go and build that so that we can clear all of that. Come and finish this off so I can clear this one. Where are all these guys? So many hanging around everywhere middle of the night again. Can you just, let's just do this a little bit quicker. Objects, doors, as soon as that is, oh, that's been sorted. Let's pop that in there. So yeah, that's about the minimum we can do. Uh, then from a construction point of view, I want to demolish these three over here. Come and sort that out down to grass. Now, can we squeeze in those other uh, large gates? No, we cannot. We cannot. That means to cancel. That means two only because they. <laughs> Oh, uh, what the hell? What the hell? That is not good. That is by no means good. So now that means this one here and actually cancel this project. Thank you. So what I'll do is I'll do that one and that one so that we can actually use this as a little bit of a larger staging area over here. Damn it, can 
can we fit a small one in? They're exactly the same size, so no, we cannot. Yeah, so build that. That is crazy. So let me get my foundations back and... Actually, what we can do... Ooh, don't do that. Uh, let's do this. Let's run that straight through there. That's way too much money. Okay, so now we can probably clear the last piece of planning that we've got going on over here. And, ooh, what I can do is let's uh, make this area a bit better. Let's go with an uh, improved piece of foundation right there. Excellent, so let's uh, go and clear that and that. So now at least we've got a better piece going on and let's get rid of all of that. So now there's a, a easier piece that we can have sorted out over there. So that's okay. So now we can effectively add a bit more stuff. So let's just, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to wait for a bit more money. So we just finish off the terminal building that we've got over here. Uh, what we can however do is we can squeeze in the large one that we were meant to be doing over here. So what the hell are you guys up to? I don't like what they're doing. Guys, seriously, is this really required? If that's what's going to happen, I just need to get rid of the... Um, Just get rid of it. Okay. Let's get rid of it and see if that... Because I think there's some kind of issue with the routing that's happening. Question. Okay, well, let's look at... Okay, so let's get the doors going again. Doors over here. So again, I'll do a nice big door right there. We need to do some gate agents. over there and over here then we can do some more of this, we'll have some seating over here Okay. Uh, actually close, this is B no, it's B3 there you go, so assign it over here and assign it there and assign it there, so good stuff now let's do some cues. Close that, thank you. Let's do some cues. How did we do the queuing? One, two, three, four, like that. There we go. we go and on this one just like that okay now this one what I'll do with this one is we'll we'll have it from there to around there and then then we'll do 
something like this or not shall we instead do this one okay get rid of that piece <laughs> come on get rid of that piece again doing the same thing get rid of that piece okay something like that this one is going to be assigned to uh, actually this one over here and it's also going to be assigned to this one right there this one is going to be assigned to this one. Excellent. So now we've actually got a setup that can work over here. We'll do a similar thing over here. Sign this one. This is coach. Sign it. And this one is first class and coach. That's it. Now we can actually get some more flights in here. And what I'm keen on is actually seeing if we can't squeeze in some of the real big ones. XL, so the 7, 747s, the A380. Let's accept the A380. Uh, requires a runway at least. Uh, okay, so we can actually get the 787 to arrive. So let's accept a uh, morning 787. Okay, and we'll not. What? It doesn't actually go to B3. It needs to go to gate C1 at. Uh, at 6 a.m. gate C1 gets a 787, a Boeing 787 Dreamliner. Extend boarding time, hover uh, the right edge and resize. Let's extend it just a tad. Give it a little bit more. Okay, so tomorrow morning we're getting our first 787 at gate C1. I'll be intrigued to see if we can sort that out. Okay, well let's uh, grab some more of these ticketing kiosks. Just, uh, oh, actually, let's uh, under it's under objects, and I want to go doors first. So let's get some doors. So if we say. Put a door there and I want to put a door there. Okay, so put the two doors in there and then what we'll do is ticketing kiosks. Okay. Let's do that. Sorted, get those ticketing kiosks up and running. Oh, and what I'll do is I'll need to grab a few more, one, two, two more of these guys. Yeah, I think uh, this is probably a better setup. Excellent. So let's have a look what's happening with our research. That's been done. Advanced ticketing. Uh, let's do fuel ports. That's quite quick though. Um, upgraded buses larger. Let's get the. Oh, I've already got the VP in there. Let's do. Oh, uh, we need a VP for finance. So let's actually get that person appointed. Uh, hire a foreman. We have finance VP. Okay, so that's been sorted out. Done.
Tons of people are squeezing through here. Oh, going out to the bathroom. All of these... Ooh, look at this. We really need to sort that out. Okay, uh, under construction, I believe we can now finally do the final bit over here. Right, so get, get working on that. Because what I want to do is I want to do the bathrooms and things like that in the center. And I want to do it nice and big. And the lounge. I want to do a nice big bathroom and and so on over here. Yes, get all of that constructed. Okay, our airport is very is nearing completion. Can't believe we had to get rid of um, of one of the gates. That's a massive, a massive issue. So it's clear that we need to leave a little bit of space in our planning. If you are planning these gates out, you need to leave a little bit of space. Seems quite clear. Okay, under objects, right, we've got some uh, screening, right, screening. So we've got a body scanner, remote bag, remote bag scanner. This advanced X-ray machine is also used by security staff to scan passenger carry-on for contraband and other security threats. But this one requires the remote security station to be used. So what does that do? A remote security station remote ah used ah excellent excellent used to monitor results of one or more assigned remote bag scanners so, oh I see so that's just a different way of doing it and the body scanner as well let's have a look at the body scanner body body scanner so what does the body scanner do a more advanced alternative to the standard metal detector so it's just more advanced so we'll throw those in oh look at that the big plane is here the 787 people are queuing how many people boarding 169 come on get everybody through there few more minutes how many people 99 percent boarded how many missed come on guys really is this required I think so I think what we're gonna need to do is we're gonna just 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 get out just get out of here <laughs> Maintenance condition. Ops panel. So, shall we runway usage income maintenance? Two five runways locked research maintenance. Okay, well, let's get maintenance research then. And the runway intersections, and fuel ports, and all kinds of things like that. need to plan out the, the front end over here too. Oh, oh, let's get rid of all of this. So let's, uh, let's slow things down just a little bit and we'll clear all of that and all of that and all of that. Okay. Now, let me uh, let's dismantle some of these benches. Okay, so if we dismantle some of that, what I'll do is in the center here, I want to... Okay, give me the planning tool. I just want to quickly have a look at the planning tool again. Um, so let's do this. So all the way from the gate to there. And we'll leave two rows there. So it's 14 by 7. Right, so if I do... Uh, 
I do that. And I do this. That is what that's going to leave us with. So, in my mind, what we'll need to do is I'm going to do a nice big bathroom over here and a nice big bathroom 14 by 7. So that does actually give us a fair bit of extra space. So what we can do is we can do, because on this side we now have room for some so but what I do th feel that we need a big bathroom over here so let's go to construction probably getting to the end of this episode uh, go for walls ever so quickly um, what I'll do is we'll do something like that and something like that seven same thing over here so we'll do seven we'll do seven we'll link that up so these will two be be two big bathrooms give me some objects give me some doors even do two doors for each of them Or shall we just do okay so now let's uh, quickly do this the planning or oh, not the planning the zones let's do uh, male bathrooms female restrooms so if I do that female restroom and then male restroom Okay, and now objects we want toilet toilet stalls. Um, actually, let's get the doors out of there and let's just make it in the center. Okay, that's about it, and then sinks. Oh, hang on. So, I need to get rid of these doors, though. Can I quickly dismantle those two, please? Yes, must be in a functional restroom, that's fine. Let's dismantle that and dismantle that. Get me the walls over there. Give me under tools, give me the door. We'll just do the one door in the center. Actually, hang on, if I grab another wall Okay, go into objects, toilet, cubicles. I know this is going to be a little crazy. Maybe what we do is we actually dismantle these. So let's dismantle these ones. Okay, give me an extra piece of wall. And then we'll do sinks on that. So let's objects and sinks.
Let's dismantle these two, just do the one. Piece of wall, wall there, wall there. And then uh, actually another piece of wall over there. And then we go for objects, we'll go for sinks. Like so, I want to go for a door over there, toilet cubicles or toilet stalls. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And then I'll do uh, go with urinals. And there we go. So there's our new restrooms over here. Hopefully that is sufficient to kind of deal with that. And I think that is where we're going to end this episode. Hopefully we need to plan out things a little bit better in here. But yeah, there's not going to be room for a lounge on this side. What I'm kind of wondering is if we then just kind of do another similar lounge type operation on this side over here. Do I ever feel that we should get rid of these small bathrooms that we've got going on over there? Okay, guys, but that's going to be me for this episode. Uh, if you've liked it, as always, please leave a like, uh, hit that button, and add some comments down below if you have some suggestions or ideas. And uh, yes, as if you liked these, if you like this series in general, please subscribe if you haven't done so already. And I will see you in the next one. Thank you. Bye bye.